the hype around artificial intelligence is under the scanner as the technology has not made a big impact in the fight against COVID-19. Today, the world needs AI more than ever to slow the spread of the deadly virus and in turn save thousands of lives. Undoubtedly, AI has taken the central stage within various organizations to drive business growth, but its effectiveness in a wide range of use cases is yet again been questioned. This is because researchers have failed to bring anything on the table that could significantly help the world fight COVID-19. However, there has been a rush of data scientists trying to predict COVID-19 spread. Data scientists have been creating a lot of tools that help explain significant questions around COVID-19. For instance, dashboard based on COVID-19 cases around the globe, chatboards to help understand the disease and other such. Using hundreds of metrics, data scientists have been trying to predict this pandemic outbreak. But the question here arises is, are these predictions accurate? The Organization for Economic Cooperation and Development has stated that the global economy could be hit by its worst growth rate since 2019, thereby dragging many countries into recession. AI has become a buzzword that can make people imagine unrealistic situations beyond the technology's capabilities. However, in challenging times, all we have got are visualizations, chatbots, thermal detectors, drones, and other such. While a few solutions help track and provide information related to the virus, everyone was expecting a groundbreaking innovation to save the world. Besides, the reliability of existing AI-based solutions for COVID-19 is another constraining factor during this crisis. For instance, detecting COVID-19 from lung scans is once a solution that is widely used today. However, computer vision models have been subjected to bias due to the shortage in the diversity of data. One more instance is the inaccuracy in Google's cancer detection solution that demonstrates how such machine learning models can provide inaccuracy accurate results. The machine learning model identifies non-cancerous changes as potential tumors. Today, the danger of trusting an unproven technology is more significant than ever. In this crucial time, when organizations have started predicting the number of people who would be COVID-19 positive, the intelligent machines are showing inaccurate results. People had higher expectations from AI researchers during this pandemic. But to their dismay, data scientists have failed to innovate anything with the current technology. However, one reason cited on why AI failed is due to the shortage of necessary data. AI relies on historical information. But since COVID-19 is entirely new to the world, it is difficult to obtain enough reliable data for machine learning models in a shorter period. Several governments were always critical of AI in healthcare, which limited its use in the sector. Recently, British startup Excientia and Japanese pharmaceutical firm Sumitomo Dainippo Pharma have developed a drug with AI, which otherwise would have taken 5 years. The AI drug just took 12 months and will be used to treat patients who have obsessive compulsive disorder. Even for AI, it takes years to develop when you have the right set of data. Then how can we expect a vaccine or a medicine for COVID-19 in just a few months? Inaccurate prediction of COVID-19 proliferation demonstrates that we lack the right data to bring value. Well then, it's not AI that disappointed us. We have failed AI by not feeding the current information to train and evaluate machine learning models. Therefore, we have unrealistic expectations from AI, at least in the healthcare industry. But this does not mean we cannot rely on AI during such crisis in the future. To know more about data science and machine learning, visit www.analyticsindiamag.com.